Yeah, Stacy and Steve, students have been trying to start a Turning Point USA chapter at Johnson High School for a little over two months now. And after heated debate from parents and board members, the group was approved. I mean, I'm tired of this. I am flat out tired of this. I just want to get this done with, dude. I mean, we got people showing up here every single day. I mean, it's never going to end. Johnston senior Lucas Gorsh voiced his frustration with school board members on Monday night. He's looking to establish a Turning Point USA chapter in Johnston High School. The conservative group says they aim to educate about freedom, free markets, and limited government. But it has split reaction from Johnston parents. Now that you know what the rules are, you need to follow them. Policies and procedures exist for a reason. What if someone were up here asking to establish a new student group only instead of TPUSA? The proposed group was the KKK. As a Johnston grad, it actually really saddens me that everyone is trying to say how racist and horrible these people are because they don't agree with you. After passionate debate from parents, the school board held a vote on the group's future to allow or not allow the group to form at Johnston. Several school board members asked about Turning Point USA's bylaws, saying they didn't have a copy of them, and Johnston's policy requires a national organization's bylaws. It's being tilted in a certain way that we're going to make a decision to hold this off again because of these bylaws. I think we say from now on we're going to hold it. That's why we want to change the policy to be very clear that we're going to follow this policy from this date going forward. Johnson School Board member Deb Davis said holding Turning Point USA to a higher standard than other clubs that already exist at the school could be in violation of federal law. So I think we have to be careful with the Federal Equal Access Act to not hold one group to a higher standard than other clubs. The school board considered delaying the final vote on Turning Point USA for a second time in order to evaluate the organization's bylaws. But after a brief recess, the board made their final decision. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Nay. Nay. All right, so the motion passes five to two. Now, Turning Point USA's website lists nine central Iowa chapters now, including Johnston. It doesn't say if those chapters are officially recognized by the districts. We're live in Johnston, Scott Carpenter, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.